In this video, you will learn how to add an average line in Microsoft Excel graph. Currently, you can see here I have generated this graph and I have inserted average line on this bar graph. If you look at this data, first column shows the months and second column shows the sales. I have calculated the average of these sales and I have draw average line on this bar graph. This line is very dynamic. If I change any value, then the position of this average line will be automatically changed. For example, if I change this value to 12,000, press enter. Now you can see here the average values is changed now and the position of this line is also changed. If I again change it back to 10,000, press enter, you can observe that the value of the average as well as the position of this line is changed. So let's start this tutorial without any further delay. If this video is helpful for you, then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. In a separate sheet, I have already entered the data to save time. Firstly, I will calculate the average. Select the cell where you want to display the result. I will select first cell. Put equal sign. Write average. Select this one. Double click on it. Now select the range of cell. After doing that, close the bracket and press enter. Now you can see here, I have closed the bracket and after that simply press enter. Now you can see here Microsoft Excel has calculated the average. Select this one, place your cursor at corner and drag it down to apply the formula on remaining rows. Now you can see here Microsoft Excel did not copy this formula accurately because the cell range is not selected correctly. To fix this problem, firstly I will remove these ones, clear contents, double click on this cell, click on first cell range and press Fn plus F4. Microsoft Excel will insert dollar sign and fix this range of cell. Similarly, click on this one, second number, and again press Fn plus F4. Microsoft Excel will insert a dollar sign. After doing that, click at the end of this formula and simply press enter. Again, click on this cell. Place your cursor at the corner and when plus sign appear, drag it down. Now you will observe that Microsoft Excel will accurately copy this formula and apply on the remaining rows. Now you can see that we have successfully calculated the average and apply this formula on remaining rows. Now our task is to generate a bar graph. Select this one. Go to insert tab and under charts you will find the option of column or bar chart. Select this one and choose first one. In this video I will not conditionally format this bar graph. If you want to generate and conditionally format bar graph then separate video tutorials are available on our channel. You can watch that videos for more details. In this video you will only learn how to insert average line in this bar graph. Now you can see here we have successfully generated a bar graph and first two columns are selected. Place your cursor at the corner. When double arrow sign appeared, you can move it in this direction and also select the average values. Now you can see here Microsoft Excel has plotted the average values and these are displayed with green bars. Select these bars, right click. And here you will find the option of change series chart type. From here select combo chart. And here you will find the option of sales and average. Click on this down arrow and from here choose line graph. And Microsoft Excel will plot the average value in the form of line as it is depicted in this graph. Click on OK. 
Now you can see your Microsoft Excel has plotted the values of average in the form of line and the average line is inserted on this bar graph. You can also format this line, select this one, right click, go to format data series and from here you will find the option of fill and line and you can choose any color according to your requirement and from here you can adjust the width of this line. So by following this tutorial you can easily calculate the average and draw average line on bar graph. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching this video. Goodbye.